Hi, before we get started in this video, please like and subscribe. And if you like what I have uh, said in this video, please hit the bell notification and subscribe to my channel. This channel um, has a whole bunch of different videos about uh, biblical concepts and also um, just concepts to improve on your life and my life as well. So please like and subscribe and thank you so much for checking in to this video. Hi, welcome to A Christian Marriage. We all have some reason that we can quit something. Marriage is like this. We cannot keep searching for reasons to break up, but reasons why to stay together. There are reasons why you should always look to stay together in marriage and keep the small things small. We cannot overlook small things our, our spouse do while fastening onto a problem and expect to win over our spouse. This saying comes from Proverbs. We need to bring wisdom into our relationships. God doesn't want people jumping around from person to person and never being able to overcome a problem. The curse of the Lord is in the house of the wicked. When it comes to our problem relationships, our problem relationships, we have to be righteous and do as Jesus commands. Only in following Jesus can we reach the standard God requires. Jesus has gone through a lot of work to bring people to a life of truth and love. Jesus said to treat others how we want to be treated. We need to seek to understand how our spouse likes to us to live and then change. Remember to give your spouse time to change. It takes time to break a habit. When reading Proverbs in the Bible, if you come across a verse that is not giving you direction, direct instruction, then you know to change your habits to that of the ways of a smart, righteous, good, loving person. Also, give people time to change into that right person if they are not all the way good yet. Thank you so much for watching A Christian Marriage, and I will see you next time.